All right, this is the uh, first test with a turbine inside this time. I ended up, uh, I had to turn it the opposite direction to uh, allow the turbine to actually work. Now this is my big injector. This is the biggest one I had. Uh, and I remember that when I ran it off of this, it didn't run as fast. So basically I'm going to do a test run with a big injector and then I'll switch it to a smaller injector. And let me put this cap on so we don't waste a lot of water. And what we're going to first show is the head pressure. That's my head pressure going into the, uh, basically with the valve cut off. Okay, we're going to start this up. Here we go. Now I'm using the same type of bushing, uh, but I got it plugged into the uh, port converter. As you can see, my pressure is about 20. And it is screaming. Even with that big injector, see what the initial test of the pressure is. It's a little wobbly. That's because I got the PVC plugged into there. I had to make an O-ring to just plug into there so it wouldn't leak. I use that little same bearing for the time being. Okay, shut this off real quick. And uh, let's start this up again. You can see how I got the... Uh, I made a, a little bushing out PVC, put two O-rings in and just plugged it right in to seal it. Looks like it works very well. I had it go in the opposite direction. Didn't look like it was going too fast. So when I switched it, it really spun up big time. So the blade, the turbine is actually helping it along the way. Okay, well, let me, uh, here's my initial load test. We're going to start this up again. Let's get a reading on that. Oh. We got about uh, 20, 22. You can see the pressure's dropping. Let me stand back because that is moving. My bearings are holding up very well. That thing is really spinning, people. And that's the big nozzle. I want to put the next one on. think of it now I know why um, Richard Klain told said something about the speed was so great it fell apart so I want to stay my distance on this you can see look at that and uh, look at my pressure absolutely drops dramatically we're down to about 15 psi so let me turn this off let me show you something have a vacuum coming in and it's taking a little time to slow down of course so let me uh, let me uh, get this primed again and I'll change the injectors to a smaller nozzle and I'm sure it's going to even go a lot faster so I'll talk to you in a little bit 